Hello and welcome to another FittingSites.com screencast tutorial. In this video we're going to cover a little bit more about custom menus inside of WordPress. And here we are on the home page of our site and what we'd like to do is we'd like to add a new item to our main navigation, the menu that appears here in the header area. And what we'd like to do is we'd actually like to create a link to another website. Uh, one reason you might want to do this is if you have, say, a second blog which is on another site and you'd like to somehow have that tab be in your main navigation or uh, a site you want to send your visitors to, perhaps an online store or some other kind of site. Any reason that you want someone to go to a different link or a different site but you want it to appear in main navigation, there's a very easy way to do that using the custom menu function of WordPress. Now, because we are logged in to this WordPress site and we have our gray admin bar up at the top, we can go directly to menus simply by hovering over appearance and then selecting menus as our option. This is a quick shortcut which gets us into the menus section of the dashboard. But you could, of course, get here yourself simply by clicking on Menus under the Appearance tab inside of the main navigation for the dashboard. So from here, within the Menus portion of the WordPress dashboard, you can see already that we have a custom link option. And it's important to realize that in order to use this, you must first have custom menus turned on and a custom menu created for your WordPress site. So if you don't have that enabled, please check out our video on how to create custom menus for your WordPress site. And here we have a custom link, and it's got a blank URL. Now, for this particular business, we also have a sister business which sells party supplies, which is a really great thing to have if you're a cupcake business, because we all know that cupcakes are perfect for parties. And what we'd like to do is we'd like to divert attention or call attention to our party supply website and maybe have some of our visitors go there as well. So what we need to do is we need to just take out the starter URL that's here and we're just going to go ahead and paste in the URL for our site. And in this case, because this would probably be pretty unattractive looking if it were a tab that said HTTP colon backslash backslash so on and so forth what we're gonna do is we're actually going to give it a label now a label is something you can give to any of the items in your custom menu so that it says something on the tab that's different from what it actually does and in this case we're just gonna go ahead and say party supplies with an exclamation point because party supplies are exciting so now all we need to do is just click on add to menu and we can see immediately that Party Supplies has been added to our menu. And we can see that it's a custom link because it says custom on it. And if we click on the gray disclosure triangle, we can roll down and see that in fact the URL is going to the right place and that we have a label for it so that it looks nice and attractive on our site. Let's go ahead and click on Save Menu. And then from here, all we need to do is just click on the site title to go to the home page of our site. And looking inside of main navigation, we can see now we have a tab called Party Supplies. And if we click on that, it takes us immediately to our other website. So just as simply and as easily as that, we can add any kind of tab onto our custom menu of WordPress, including links to other sites. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.